we're going to show you how and why we use a certain number. Before we get going, let's label our diagram up above. We have the travel, which is always opposite the perpendicular corner. It's the blue line, and it's always the longest side of the triangle. In this 45 degree set, the offset and the run are the same dimension. The offset is the green line, and it's always opposite the angle of turn. And the run is going to equal the offset. Sometimes the run is called the advance. So in this problem, let's make our offset 10 inches. So if our offset is 10 inches, then we take the 10 inches and times it by a constant multiplier of 1.414, and that will equal your travel. So our travel is going to equal 14 and an eighth. So where did that number come from? Well, let's explain this to you. In any right angle, triangle, the square of the hypotenuse equals the sum of the square of the other two sides. So in this triangle, we could say c squared equals a squared plus b squared, or c equals a squared plus b squared, all under the square root key. So in pipe fitter terms, we could say the travel equals the offset squared plus the run squared, all under the square root key. So let's keep this real simple. Let's make the offset one and the run one. So one squared plus one squared, all under the square root key, will equal our travel. So let's do that. One squared plus one squared equals two. So the square root of two equals 1.414. So that's where that number comes from. 1.414 is the square root of 2. We can also solve this problem using some trig. As you can see here, our sine is opposite over hypotenuse. Or we could use the cosecant, which is be easier because then we can multiply. It's the hypotenuse divided by the opposite will give us our cosecant number. So if we use 10 inches as our opposite, and we get the cosecant number, then we can multiply our cosecant number times 10 to achieve the hippo. So with our calculator, we could go convert clear, we could go 45 and get sine, but that's not the number we want, we want the inverse. Convert 1 over x, 1.414 times 10 inches, gives us a travel of 14 in the 8th.